All right, so here is a passion, passion flower plant. And you can see that zebra right there, this, that zebra long wing right there that's twitching around, he is molting right now. So what he's doing is he's actually crawling out of his own skin because he got too big for his skin. Caterpillars molt in the same way as snakes. Um, now, molting does take a little while, so if, if you want to skip, that's fine. Um, but caterpillars molt the same way as snakes do. They just... Um, like their skin kind of splits open and you can see right there that part with the white little white points that's his new skin and you can actually kind of see where it's going he's pulsating and if we look if we look at the bottom of the long wing caterpillar you can see that the skin is going to start to become like condensed condensed down there if if you you can see those white polka dots are the zebra the zebra long wings new spikes you can see that zebra has spikes um and you can see all those spikes they're starting to condense down at the bottom um and once he's done shedding his skin, his old skin is just going to be a mess of spikes. Um, because you can see, this zebra, this is a normal zebra that has already molted the same in star as this guy after he molts. But, here's a new, freshly molted zebra. So, yeah, you can see, clearly, there's difference. Um... And there we go. So the spikes are all condensing down towards the butt area. And they're going to come off his body and they're just going to fall down. Probably onto that that little, little unlucky zebra caterpillar. But now he's done molting. Um, almost done molting. He just has a little more to go. Then he'll be done. And that, this is a freshly molted zebra longwing. Just molted about a half an hour ago. And you can just see there's his old skin. It's a mess of spikes. And there's his new spikes. So that's what that guy is going to look like once he's done molting. And now he is done molting. So what's going to happen is now that he's done molting, Fluid, like blood and other fluids, other bodily fluids, are going to be pumped into the spines. Because you can see, this zebra, his spikes are like that, but this zebra doesn't have that many. Spikes aren't jagged like that. So that's going to happen, and fluid's going to pump into the spikes and make them longer, and he's going to... In probably a day or two, he's going to be, his new skin is going to harden, and he's going to be a third in-star zebra longwing caterpillar. So, can't wait for that. Alright, so this was um, zebra, this was a zebra longwing caterpillar, molting into its third in-star. Um, very... Very cool event. It happens all the time here. Um, hopefully we'll get to show you one of these zebras or one of these uh, gulf fritillaries here turning into a chrysalis because that's a really cool sight. That seeing them turn into a chrysalis. That Those are the coolest sights in the caterpillar world. Alright, so I'll see you I'll, there's probably going to be a new video in a few days. Um, alright. Bye!